guys and welcome to my channel my name is Biscuit I do reaction videos to music and I'm a Twitch streamer as well I am super excited for today's reaction because we are gonna go um, into a new band they are called Dream Theater um, I know that you guys have been suggesting this band a lot and you did give me a few great uh, recommendations from their music but um, I've decided to go with their new song it's called The Alien and I've chosen this because they actually won um, a Grammy with it so I'm definitely curious to see you know the award-winning song I think this will be a great platform to go into the band um, so without further ado we should just go into it as well I did do a little bit of research uh, I did check if the band posted the lyrics um, to the song. I unfortunately did not, so I went uh, beforehand and I read them. I really do want to give my best. I, I'm trying to understand um, as well the meaning behind it. Uh, so if you like the reaction videos, please don't forget to like and subscribe. I really do appreciate that a lot, a lot, a lot. So let's go. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm ready, I'm ready. I really liked a lot this uh, this change in the rhythm. Uh, I hope I, I get it right here. So there was that, that constant rhythm at the beginning and then they just uh, jumped into changing of the rhythm. Usually until now I kind of understood that this is like the, the signal of a change in uh, the rhythm or uh, the beginning of like you know something fearless or something like that. Uh, I will admit I'm not you know, like, I'm not uh, too into this uh, alien, starships, UFOs and everything. Like, this is not my type of uh, science fiction thingy. But I'm always intrigued by it. Um, I, I do believe that this is where the title, the alien, comes from. So um, let's, let's hear again that change. Yeah, I like this. No, no, no. Now, now I got my ears formed from this kind of stuff. Uh, I absolutely loved that guitar. I don't know, but it's something about it. It, it feels like it tells a story on their own. Uh, I did like a lot to see this footage of the first um, spaceship and, you know, like the solar system and like 
mankind achievements over the years i think that was really 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 beautiful uh that's a big intro but as well from what i understood from your comments and um, your basically kind of pre-information uh dream theater is actually making super long songs which i love because if if it's a good song i feel like it's always finishing too soon so um, i i think we're gonna have a good relationship until now until now it starts off um kind of lays out the story i believe uh it shows like the e the alien um the match the new the new tech and the new um the a dna and everything so I, I i do believe we are creating something but in the same time i believe we are looking backwards at what mankind uh, already kind of achieved you know the the launch of the rocket and so on so I, i'm i'm trying to picture the story already Okay, this is this actually might be one of the most interesting voices I've heard until now into like this kind of like a, a genre. I think I read that actually Dim Tid is a progressive metal band. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. I will definitely want to know um, because I do I do like this kind like um the one who's shifting between the genres like we have the beautiful guitar and then you know like we go with the drums in, into like a super uh, heavy rhythm and everything like this and but this voice this voice is very light i want to say light like it has like a, a, a high tone like i think the lead singer sings a little bit um on a high notes which it gives a little interesting um effect to it i do like it i i'm i'm uh, i'm trying to focus a bit on this um i'm actually curious if they used of uh, pictures and actual footage from the universe because nowadays you can find literally everything you want on the internet i i did look at some pictures they take in space and so on and that that those were great i'm actually curious if they use those here too um i would admit it would have been super super helpful if the lyrics would have been available um but until now i did understood a little bit of uh having the means to expand to explore to evolve um i'm i'm trying to understand because you know how it is i think you can take it in into um into two ways you can Take it literally i mean they're literally talking about the universe they're literally talking about mankind evolving discovering and so on or otherwise you can go a little bit more on the um, creative side and you can go and say oh yeah they're actually talking about their music they're actually talking about their uh, way of singing or uh, of their way of presenting the band because um i didn't understand that the band is actually for a few years on the market already and um, I do believe it's important for a long-term band on the market to be able to evolve, create, adapt. So I am uh, I'm, I'm always torn in between the two meanings which I, I, I can kind of guess that's happened here. 
Uh, so let's continue with this. Uh, let's listen to this voice, see if we can kind of crack it more. Uh, and uh, I, I would have loved to see them, them, them perform. Maybe we can do that later on in the video. Until now, all this footage and all of these pictures and like, you know, it's, it's linked to the title. Very good. Like the alien space, astronauts, space and aliens. Makes sense. Sorry, I loved that countdown. Um, I I literally liked it. I think that's a great add to the song. Um, it was a little. I literally just caught it maybe like around four, three. Like those were the the numbers I can understood. But I I immediately got that it was a countdown because of the images as well. This video is very nicely put. Look at this. Ah, this is nice. Oh? It sounds like drums, but it's not drums. What is this instrument playing here? Uh, uh, I'm gonna go with a guess. Do you know those little drums? Probably they're not called drums, but like the little drums thingy and you don't go with like your hands sounds like that Are those those until now? I swear to god. I I must oh, I cannot say that I love um, uh, Shiny shiny sparkly sparkly like um, I love those shiny shiny sparkly um, So like this video is is making my eyes go bling 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 um so many colors, so many stars, so many everything. Like I, I love it. I love it. I maybe not everybody's into that, but I do like it. And I like it how the images as well changes when the instruments either uh pick up or uh, they change the rhythm and everything. But I'm super intrigued by this instrument here. I will start it, and you guys will hear it. I do believe like it's one of those drums you put it with your uh, with your palms. I don't know how it's called. You let me know in the comment section. Um. Let's go again. This one.
stop, stop, stop. Okay, so I'm just gonna say this. I am very grateful from for this video uh, because it's not something I, I legit, legit have to look for details or clues or anything like this. So I can focus more on the instrument and I did pick up, um, you know, I'm, you probably know I I just I'm I'm still going for it okay I'm I'm more more are my guesses so you have to correct me if I'm wrong because I do want to learn and this is what everything is about right so when the guitar's going I did hear like a clink 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 and at the beginning I was literally thinking that it's one of those like triangles you know the metal triangle you go with the ding 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 but then I remember I I saw it um I saw it this I saw this before for another band and it's actually the drums the the man you did tell me how the, the discs were called they're not called discs they're not called drum disc they have a name and it starts with a c and i forgot the name again but the drummer is doing that ting 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 and i know it now and i'm super grateful for this because i can actually listen and i listen to this okay when this uh new image comes up and it looks like if you look at it, it looks like a tornado, but the instrument sounds like a tornado as well. The guitar would, I, I don't know, it gives me the impression that it sounds like a tornado as well. Let's just look and just imagine it as well. And now. Okay, so even if this is a new song, basically, I think it was 2021 released, um, I still hear in the voice of the singer and in the, the instruments an old touch. Um, hmm, how can I explain this? So after I, I listen to some Queen, after I listen to some ACDC, after I listen to like these old uh, legends, like but you know what i mean bands who did music way before 90s let's call it like that i i hear in this band that that touch in it even if this is a new song and in the same way i'm actually considering the meaning of the lyrics i i did hear that he said i am the alien of a new mankind or something like something something some similar to that and i'm i'm just remembering that at the beginning of the the video they were like um creating this new alien this new form of life so i'm super conflicted and i think this video is up to free opinions and it's up to free interpretation so i'm just gonna go with mine at the end uh but um i have to because i have to so <laughs> opinions i think this is what it's about commentary right um but until then i'm just gonna keep it like this i i like the mix i like the new and i think i will love the old as well so let's let's continue okay so i think we are on mars <laughs>
These changes. Amazing. I'm super pleased. I am actually super pleased. So, like I said, this is so I can hear myself a little bit better. So, like I said, I do believe this is up for interpretation and free opinion and everything like this. Uh, let's just go first with the literal sense. Alien, New World, New Mankind, Exploring, Mars. Uh, I think that was some footage with the little... Man, I wish I could give you names. Well, at some point, we did send this little robot, I don't know how it's called, on Mars to like gather samples and, you know, like do, 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 do the spacey job, job thingy. Uh, so I think that was probably what that little robot space at the end um, on the red planet meant. Um, so we're just going to go with this literal... You look, you see, you see this, you just think about evolution, um, transportation on other planets, visiting, evolving, creating somewhere else, um, you know, just basically going and evolving. I'm just going to go with evolution here. Um, and I think that that definitely might be the reason like if if you don't want to look a lot a little bit into it i think you can just go with this and i don't think you can actually fail because you know like all the images the universe the spaceship the astronaut the the alien which probably will be us because you know we are not on earth anymore so then we will be on another planet which might be considered we are the aliens there right but then me, I am thinking that it can be, um, you can consider this being their new uh, way of making music. They, because they said I'm the alien, right? So maybe Dream Teaser is trying to point out that they want to evolve with their music. They want to create around this new era where they said they have more... Uh, more ways to expand like we had some lyrics saying that as well maybe they want to say that they are able to adapt to what the public is you know evolving with because for example me like i would be the new mankind right because i just got uh, to get to know the band so maybe they will want to say that they will try to make music for the new generations as well they will become a mix in what they had, like the old version, let's say it like this, the old touch they had in their music, and implement, create the new alien into into their music. That could be as well a, a way of interpreting the song. And, and I do believe that this is the beauty of music and art in general. It's up to interpretation. It's up to opinions. It's up to see how your mind is exploring this kind of stuff which i love i love to do that um you can definitely see this however you want but after all everything like this you just have to sit down and accept this is a beautiful song both meanings are great uh, creating new thing evolving and adapting is definitely something we all have to do in our day-to-day -day life because this is how we kind of learn how to cope with our issues with our problems how to develop more strengths and more personality traits as well this this is just this is, this is just great it's a great song to motivate for you to become better to become a better version to just basically do more do better do everything that's helpful for yourself for mankind for the new mankind for basically everyone else i do like this song i i love all the instruments um and the different ways they use the instruments like we heard normal drums then we heard the, the, this going on and and not making an extra complex video for the song helps the listener especially the new listeners like me to appreciate more the 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 instrument like i said the lead vocalist has a very interesting voice i'm definitely mm, gonna look more into him the lead 
oh the lead vocalist because it's it's very peculiar for me i don't know it has something special to it i i'm very curious about that um this over it, it's just a beautiful song i do understand why they won the grammy with it i definitely understand um it's for sure worth checking out i do hope you like it and i do hope you like the reaction as well and if you do it please don't forget to like and subscribe i appreciate that a lot and if you want to discuss about this or any other subjects with me uh you can find me on twitch 7 p.m german time i do stream almost daily i would say so i invite you there pass by say hi have a chat have a coffee have you know just good old conversations into the new mankind uh, way of communicating via internet, online chatting, everything like this. It's definitely a good way to, you know, um, maybe develop some social skills, communication skills. Um, it's, it's, just, it's just good to try that as well. So uh, that's it for today. I really do hope you like it and I will see you tomorrow with another reaction. Thank you all. Bye bye.